0049 here with a new kind of video. As you guys already know, I am mostly known for doing live streams, but I have figured out that I can play mobile games on my phone and I edit them pretty decently. So the game that we are going to be playing today is called Slenderman Beyond Fear. And if you guys have ever seen my live streams, I am normally a big pussy when it comes to scary games. So, let's get into it! By the way, I have my lights off in my room, and I'm playing this, so, yay! Play button's not pushing. Okay, there we go. Okay. Seems like someone's talking to the police. Like he's laughing. No, <laughs> Anyone else think that sounds like an act? Thomas the train? <laughs> Why is he yelling? <laughs> it sounds like he's laughing. What the fuck? <laughs> Okay, that last part was kind of creepy. What? It's right behind you, and then the cops start shooting. How much does this fucker weigh? I thought he was a Slender Man. End of tape. By the time the other officers got to the room, no one was. In s oh, oh, thank you for letting me fucking read that. Thomas nearly. <laughs> along with the other officer been missing since. Why is it stopped? Ah, fucking ad. Hello. 
Oh, okay, I guess I was supposed to push that. Oh wait, what? I'm already in it? I can already tell that I don't like this. It's not even telling me what to fucking do. Okay, well I can run. Find the key to open. Blood on the floor. I thought Slenderman was about eight pages and stuff. It's probably a knockoff version. If it's a knockoff version, then it's probably not going to be that open, that scary. And I need to find a key to open all of this. Is there supposed to be a key at the car or something? Sorry, I thought I heard something. Why does it seem like my car's further away than it was before? Oh wait. This is a cop. Alright. Just making sure I can't open that. Pretty easy mechanic. I saw I know how to open doors. Alright. Okay, either I don't have a flashlight or it sucks. scary so far. Sorry for being quiet. I'm not the best with horror games, and to be honest, me not seeing him is getting me a little more worried than me seeing him. How is that noise?
What the fuck was that? I literally dropped my phone just now. <sighs> okay, no more running through doors. I have the shivers now. <laughs> I didn't like that. I didn't think this game would actually be that scary. I thought it was going to be like kind of sucky to be honest. It was free. <sighs> okay. <sighs> it's probably the only jump scare until I get the key. So <clears throat> I'm fine. Why is that tree purple? Why the fuck was that door moving? <sighs> so I'll find it dandy before that first jump scare. Maybe he dropped a key or something. I can't kind of lie, I'm hesitant to go in here, but... Nothing. Oh! How did I miss this? Great, now I'm going into the blood covered house. I don't like this. Okay. Can I have a key, please? So sad. I thought I saw tentacles for a second. I swear to god, I don't like horror games. I okay, said so now I'm going in here. Gimme. Where that barrel come from? Is 
I swear I'm gonna have a fucking heart attack next to this game. No, leave me alone. Oh god damn it, I couldn't move, I was too scared. <sighs> Such fucking bullshit, I swear to god. Wait, do I have to do it all again? gonna spawn. Maybe if I... Run! Run, you asshole! It's safe. So it saves progress. Thank god. Now I'm down to 40 health. What the fuck? In a way it's creepy, but at the same time it's like really cheesy. Fuck it, I'm going back to my car. I seen enough. Just let me go home. Seriously? Literally just stared at a monster and I'm not allowed to leave. If he kills me, I'm giving up. I'm sorry. Bam. I just can't take this. <laughs> My heart. I'll try to run past him. Or, wait. Maybe crouch? Well, that's not fair.
maybe I'll come back to this game when I figure out how to beat it. But till then, I guess see you guys in the next video. And I hope you enjoyed seeing me get scared, even if it wasn't that much. To be honest, once you see him the first time, the first jump scare is the one that gets you. The second one, it'll kill you and it freaks you out a bit, but when you're looking at the CGI... Okay, I'm not going to downgrade this game. It, people, Somebody put a lot of work into this, I will admit that. Even though it kind of sounded like he was snickering when he did the voice acting. And the monster itself isn't bad, but it kills you like in three hits. So you can't run past it. But other than that, this is actually a well built game. And I feel like if you're. if anybody's ever beat this, please leave in the comments and let me know. <laughs> and also. Give me some advice on how to handle scary games because I'm sure my friends are going to want me to do more of these.